Oh, damn, this looks nice. Oh my god. Probably 30 frames a second, but uh, graphics are impressive. Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess. It, it does look a little bit um, like just without the cape, for sure. Yep, Demon Souls. Uh, Bloodborne is, is on the shelf next to Medea with, with how difficult they both are. Yeah, st starting Jon Snow, for sure. <laughs> this is going to be difficult. Selecting like the ten health thief and trying to trying to go with it. I feel like that intro was really really good because it like filled in a lot of blanks in like uh, Dark Souls where that obviously looked like the Dark Souls one city and like people going insane when they have their soul ripped out of them but they're still active and attack other people. It feels like this is the intro to Dark Souls one. The bits we never knew. This is like Dark Souls one prequel. Standard attack with R1. There it is. I have to look for a bit, but back a little later. Never played this one at all, so it should be fun. Yeah, it should be. I've never played this one at all either. Damn. Ooh. Wonder if I do a strong attack. Seems like. That L1. Yield, nice. And the parry. We got him. Yeah, Dark Souls 1 before Dark Souls 1. There it is. You said it way better than I did. You should stream and I'll and I'll watch. <laughs> Direction to hold to sprint. Yep. Stand standard defeat. Let's uh quickly try the other mode of um Ooh, cool menu. Um, it was like a second graphical mode that was like, oh, higher frame rates, but uh, better performance. Let's try this one. Oh, there we go. There's some more frames per second. It still looks nice. I don't have the oozing charisma to be the face man. What, you think I do? <laughs> I certainly don't. L1 to guard? Yep, cool. Maybe I'll try and parry again. Sort of looks like I'm getting the parry, but it's not doing anything. Oh well. No, no special critical kill, but it was something. Uh, R3 to target lock. Yep. And release. And yep. To change the target. Sure. Whoa. It's a ghost of a person. I guess the online is sort of there, but or maybe that's the kind of storyline. This is nice though. I think that ghost might be like a storyline ghost, because why would any players be constantly rushing from this door up those stairs? Oh, what's this rope? Damn. It's hoping to cut the rope. Square to use item, 
and down to switch. Okie doke. Lots of healing items. Um, oh. So, use the direction and hold circle. The vault over railings. Wait, this railing here, I'm assuming we're going to vault over. But let's just check out the door. Playing Minecraft and watching a true multitasker. Oh, wow, you can Ooh. jump over stuff in Demon Souls. This is now officially the, the most complex game because you've got you've got an actual parkour move that you can use. Beautiful. <laughs> Try and get around the back and see if I can go for the back stamp. I can. Oh, it looks great. The same problem as uh, Bloodborne, though. I think the, the volume's a little bit off. We'll try that, see how it goes. Whoa. There's a, there's a growling coming from behind, behind that door. Yeah, uh, Demon's Souls is a really, really, really old game. This released before Dark Souls 1. But this is a remake, slash remaster, slash whatever you want to call them, by another company. Like, they took FromSoft's game and just said, what if we made it today, Scrappics? Yeah. So this remaster is a PlayStation 5 exclusive, as far as I know. So it's only as old as the PlayStation 5. Oh, my bonfires are called Archstones, and they... Well, no, they're not. This warped me. I've just been, just been teleported. But yeah, the original was a PlayStation 3 game, right? So it's like gonna play through I assume like the PlayStation 3 game but like they didn't use any of the anything from it R2 strong attack I'm assuming it's just built from the ground up hey Silas Playing Demon Souls today. Just started actually, not not that long ago. L2 to parry, repel an enemy attack. After parrying, use R1 to repost. Although that hasn't seemed to work out for me so well. Uh, yeah, really, really good. I really like how Demon Souls looks. It looks like it's going to be a, a fun game. But Bloodborne was too hard. I had to shelve it because I needed many more level ups. Just grinding levels is going to be uh, a little bit boring to watch. Wow. Oh my goodness. Well, I think we can safely say I got the parry off there. That was brutal. Oh, this guy looks crazy. Well, failed the first couple of parries, but we got there in the end. Triangle to wield weapon with both hands, slash release. Two handed dagger. Obviously, best dagger. Let's 
So we got an upstairs and we got a door. Oh, all the doors in this game so far have been painted on. No real doors for me. Uh, switch left and right hand weapon. Yep, sure. With bow equip. R2 to shoot. Okay, I do have a bow. Can I... Yeah, I can hold L L1 to get the aiming mode as well. That's always good. Uh... Oh, L2 for precision and aim mode. What was L1 doing then? In precision aim mode, you can zoom with up and down. Really? Wow. Cool. Seemed awfully mean, but gotta do what you gotta do. Unknown warrior soul. And some more present moon grass. I don't know if I ever shared this with you, but a while back, over a period of like two weeks, I hyperfixated on creating my own language from scratch. Coming back to it now, I have 16 pages worth of language rules and a list of roughly 320 English words to translate into this language. Oh my god, you've been working hard. <laughs> Here's me just like sleeping and uh, eating, and then there's you living your life. Damn. Very impressive. Whoa, ouch. I might have to use one of these healing items someday. Hmm. Do I really want to enter the fog? I guess I should. the project with next to no knowledge of linguistics learned a lot yeah i bet you did without coming up all of all of that stuff jeez the lighting is just amazing in here awesome Uh oh. Second fog door. What have we got? Thank God, demon. Uh. Ooh. Wow. Immediately kind of half as I entered the room. You died. However, the Nexus traps you, you shall remain, uh. And then the tooltip was gone before I could even, like, learn what I was gonna say. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Sorry, I got someone looking after me. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. Thou canst not quit the Nexus, but the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. You have died and the Nexus has imprisoned your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. Ah, oh, that sounds like a challenge to me. I bet I can escape the Nexus. 
Oh, however, by capturing demon souls, you can reclaim your corporeal body. Lucky me. And I got a Nexial binding. wonder if that's a ring. It is not. Never mind. So is there any way for me to see what the stats do, I wonder? See, normally I'd press select, but on the PlayStation 5 controller, they kind of got rid of select and turned it into a screenshot button. I'm going to try a few different buttons on here, see if I can get it to... Nope, I can't seem to get like an information panel up. Very annoying. I'll try the select button, but no, it's going to ask me if I want to take a screenshot. Nope. I guess I don't get to know what any of these stats do. Thanks, game. <laughs> what, a, what a strange thing. Like, if they hadn't gotten rid of the select button, it could have been that. Meh. I guess I don't need to know what the stats do. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Politaria? That is the same voice actor as the miserable guy in Dark Souls 1 that you meet. And he's a miserable guy. They use the same voice actor. That's so cool. You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? Bah, it's all the same. You're just another prisoner of the Nexus. Wow. We well, welcome here. Great. As long as we keep slashing up demons. <laughs> Damn. This is a high quality production. Hmm. You new here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons, or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? Yeah, cool. Hmm. I can get a second dagger at some point. I wonder if I can use one in each hand. So we've got sharpening stones that cost 2,000 to fix the durability on your right hand weapon. Ouch. And you know, arrows and stiff. And if you haven't heard, there's another blacksmith at the entrance to Stonefang Mine. He's an eccentric old man. He knows his trade well. He's the only sane one left in a town of soul-starved men. If you do meet him... No, forget it. That stubborn old native will, will just chase you off. No interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last long here. Ah, oh, come on, bro. Just because I didn't shop with you doesn't mean you need to tell me I'm going to die. I'm Stockpile Thomas. When the scuds came, I didn't know what hit me. When I came to, I found myself here in this nexus. My wife and daughter fell victim to the demons. But I would be worthless in battle. At the very least, 
I hope to lend my assistance to you brave slayers of demons. I would be happy to lighten your load and look after any excess baggage. Wow, the storage is a man, not a box. Interesting. When the scourge came, I abandoned my wife and daughter and fled like a coward. Oh, no. When I came to, I was in this nexus. I haven't dared venture outside these walls since. I wish I could do more. But <laughs> I am ignorant of the world beyond these walls. <laughs> I do. I need to call in some kind of doom slayer. Like, um... I think I think dwarven slayers would would do well here. From Warhammer. Best of luck to you. There's a great big door over this way. Though, look at that. I wonder if this is something. Oh, these. Whoa, messages. No stamina. Your shield defense effective. Stamina is consumed. Oh my god. I'll stop if I find one that I don't know. A lot of tutorial tips just jammed in one corner. So one of soul form your HP is halved, that seems new. And also if you use a weapon with both hands you can easily break an enemy's guard, seems new. This is for online play. As the tendency approaches black, demons will pose more of a threat. That's new. Pay attention to, uh, attention to the tendency of the world's souls. New. As the tendency approaches white, the strength of demons diminishes. Ooh, how fun. Anyone else I need to meet in this place? I kind of don't like how they've added a panting sound to the guy when he's running in the game. Yeah, I, I get it, but also I'm going to spend a lot of this game running. Do I really need somebody groaning all the time? This Nexus place is huge. How am I supposed to find it? Well, I was just trying to say hi to the person that revived me, but apparently, no. Doesn't seem to be anyone else here. Right, so I was also told if I want to get back out to the world, touch one of the stones, off you go. And... I guess that's what I'll do. The graphic was for the one right behind him. So let's try and touch the archstone of the covetous king, which might be level one. Uh, we can go to the gates of Bolitaria. A huge stone castle in the heart of the northern kingdom of Molotaria. Hungry soldiers attack trespassers, their souls stolen by demons. On nearby terrible dragons have taken roost. Didn't take us long to get into dragons, but okay, I'm, I'm with it. Demons and dragons. 
Cool. Reminds me of Dark Souls 1. Red Dragon on a Bridge. One that I thought didn't have a bunch of uh, food in his mouth there. I don't know. I'm sure the website will tell you if you have per permissions to uh, use their works for free, but I don't have any idea. Looking for permissions for things, it's, it's kind of difficult sometimes. A lot of people like upload stuff and don't really think about if they they want to give you the permissions. Go off the side, as long as this door isn't locked by anything. It is. situation we're in. No problem. I'll just continue walking around with next to no health. I'm sure I'll be fine. Now might be time for a health potion. Oh my goodness. Your sword's on fire, sir. Now I'm on fire. It's going wrong for everybody. So the front door is not open. And neither is this side. Well, that narrows things down. This way or bust. 